So this will be six damage. It's not quite lethal. I think we're we have to play for Gimme Nuts anyway. And then we'll set up the bullseye. Okay, now you really well, what can you can at most play a bungee club in this turn. So Cactus wins again! Cactus wins! <laughs> Easy! And again, the bullseye does matter there. Wow. What's going on everybody? This is Fry. So today we are doing OT Cactus. OTK of course stands for one turn kill. Uh, the idea is if you have to kill it on the field, everything attacks with their health. So you can actually have some really efficient plays with just Cactus and then you can double its health getting it to 10 damage bullseye uh, with great responsibility. So that's three. So if it's turn seven, you can plan food. If it's turn six, you can just... Play time to shine. It seems like there's a lot of potential. Speed you can do the same thing with, with garlic. That has the same stats, but it's not bullseye. I think anyway, cactus just being able to add some bullseye damage, kind of like maybe play this with the guardian package. But of course, we're running the uh, forget me nuts and the triceratops and the photosynthesizer. So there's going to be a lot of ways of uh, killing opponents. We can play the tempo game. We're also running four copies of Health Nuts, so again, either the Photosynthesizers and or the Great Responsibility will give that a ton of health. You can do it with the Pecanolith itself too, if you have Pecanolith set up. Uh, just doubling this health already makes it do 14 damage. Uh, so we're definitely going to be going for a one turn kill with something fancy. I just like the fact Cactus is Bullseye, it means you don't have to worry about the block meter. Maybe we'll get a really good, just even just Cactus plant food with Pecanolith on the field can very often finish off opponents. Let's see how the deck does. Hope you guys enjoy. We'll get right into the game. I think the other thing we're trying here is just Guardian Package with Pecanolith as a finisher rather than cards like Gatling that we typically more use. Uh, I think Pecanolith is viable. Only one way to find out. I think this deck will go. Eight wins out of ten vote. Yeah, seven and three or fewer vote. And over here at the live stream, twitch.tv forward slash fry and up. Big game? Did I forget? Uh, thank you. There it goes. So now what do we do? I think we just make this go face. Ours is better. the heads up about the YouTube thingy. Why did I not change anything? Oh, we have Shamrocket, so let's let him cover this. Hey, oh, it's just this 2 damage. It's a 2-1. Until he covers it, and then it gets worse. So we're just playing on tempo here. Maybe we'll even have Shamrocket Garlic next turn on turn 4. That'll be really good. Who are the voice actor for PvZ Heroes? Apparently it was just anyone around the studio. They would be like, okay, who wants to make a... Who wants to make a Super Brain so Nass out now and stuff like that. Unfortunately, it's not Shamrocketable. Fortunately, it's not a shamrock and bowl. So to do six damage to this is a problem here. I think we just set up Triceratops and we'll set up Garlic. We could set it up here because the Pecanolith, it'll protect the Pecanolith next turn. Also prevents three damage here. It's pretty good. Kenilith is probably going in one. On life, it's a 1-1 one, one here. Let's see free cakes that. Okay. 
Don't really need that Triceratops to live right now. We've got lots of other stuff going on with the Bacanalith. Hell yeah. Uh, I just hope he doesn't have like a fruitcake for the Bacanalith here. That would suck. Hank? God damn it. Very likely gonna have a fruitcake, but we'll see. Yes, thinking cap. Oh, hallelujah. So we're killing the con man, trading it just for a garlic. Picanolith is alive and healthy. Then we got three damage bullseye. I love that. Maybe we can do something with this cactus next turn and not proc his block. Uh, if we got grape. Grape responsibility would have been lethal here. Eh? Too bad. La 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 la. I think four, four Bullseye is worth it, because now this becomes lethal. Even if he kills the Picanola. So that's fine. Oh, we doing good? <laughs> Drawing cards. He has a couple of superpowers. Deadly is not going to get it done. And just like that, the first game we essentially got OTK Cactus. was the only way of finishing him off there without him blocking. So hell yeah, Iron Set for eight months. I bet my wife and kids on this day. <laughs> Jeez, you had me at wife. You don't gotta get you don't gotta get your kids involved. Damn. We need a leap. We need a leap. <laughs> Lazarus, thank you for eighteen months. Day two of trying to say completely ridiculous things with a straight face. People who don't vote are kind of cringe. Wow. Judgmentals. Alright. We have some health nuts. This guy is hilarious just from the name. <laughs> That's his name. The Super Brains player. I didn't make the name. Galacta is pretty damn good. We're gonna save the Heights lane, the non-laser based alpha lane, for something a little more powerful than you. Worst case scenario, a whole of Flora and draw into something here. What's in the box of wine? So, the guy who doesn't have small removal, aka super lame. I'm actually gonna put this here, so. He can't kill a 2 1. It would have to be. No, teleport and what? No, there's nothing to teleport in. Uh, beam me up costs 3 when you play this. I have the, uh, the protection. So even though I typically want to use this on a health nut, uh, it should be worth it here. La 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 la. So I think we just set up cactus. Oh, that's a really cool. That's a really cool coffee grounds for this deck. See what we can do with it. Maybe that one of the health nuts should be on the ground though. But yeah, it just trades his turn three for a Galactic Cactus, and the Forget-Me-Nuts is alive and well. Looks like that's really messing him up, because he hasn't made up plays in sweet. Well, he hasn't really done anything. So that could be Pogo. In which case, this would be a terrible two-for-one. Actually, I, I think we're always playing Health Nut here. The question is, are we committing a great responsibility? I think because we have plant food and we can combine this together on turn 5, I'm just gonna play around Pogo for now. Man, we're kicking it right now. We kicking it! No, 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 no. 
really hard for super brains to deal with the sword I think. Uh, just spreading the board is gonna be the play here. <laughs> so slow. Does he have a one drop? Right. Oh, he does. It's smoke bomb. If we roll a one here, we win. Otherwise, the plant food will just take him out next turn. La, 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 la. Super brain's power, and now he doesn't even know what to do. Should have gone here. Right? I want to do it with the uh, health nut just to be extra fancy. We have it too. Oh my gosh, it's so much damage. Come on, man. Bruh. We'll do it with. I mean, this is lethal, but it's no fun. Ah, guys, look. It's OTK Cactus. I didn't realize we have two types of cactus in this deck. This <laughs> is such BM, by the way. What does he have? Deadly? We are deadly? Now what? This is complete BM. I know I could have just blind footed the Triceratops. I don't care. The cactus explodes. <laughs> guys, it's the cactus tag team combo. These guys could definitely be wrestlers together. Come on. Tag him in. This guy, his fa finisher move, he, is he just dies. He just explodes. His guts just get all over the arena. <laughs> you dead. Wow, that was dark. I don't know how he... Jeez. Alright, we're 2-0. Oh. Get shrekt. I wanted to do the, the thing, though. The, the extra thing. Flash! Okay, I'll stop being here. That hits me. La 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 la. That's pretty good. Um, the advice I have against Rust Ball, unless he plays Teacher on one, is uh, save this for later because you'll be able to deny. You know, this can get Rolling Stone done too. This can deny more value later in the game. Like if he's going for a three cost trick, then playing this on three denies him three brains instead of one. Maybe it is good here, though, because we have pretty good tempo. He can still Rolling Stone next turn. I guess I'd rather this get Rolling Stones than pass turn one. You know, against a guy who passes turn one, I'd probably rather this get Rolling Stone than Forget-Me-Nuts. This could also still be a Flag Zombie deck. We'll find out right now. Oh, string Jackbox games. Maybe, uh, maybe late. So that's cool. I think this is still fine. It won't, we'll help him up. Means he can't play Rolling Stone. Yeah, though. Just... I might want to play this on the ground. Gabriel, was that you? Ha ha ha, guy. Good game. GG. No, 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 no. Maybe I'll just use the cattail to protect the forget me nuts. You can't weed spray. I think this is fine. Artipia. Just got gifted from Rock Pikmin. Thank you for existing. Artipia. I don't know, is that weird? If we had a great responsibility, we could actually win the game right now. This would be lethal. <laughs> the real OTK. No, 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 no. 
This is probably the best one. I don't want to use the time to shine unless I know we're going to get some face value. Uh, it takes out what's probably going to end up being a powerful card. If he has Rolling Stone, then we essentially trade a Flying Foo for a Paparazzi. Ooh, okay. So we got that potential, that OT, OTK potential. Still going on right now. This right now is lethal. Ooh, and he didn't have a Rolling Stone. I like it this way. <laughs> la 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 yo dad. Ah, uh, I'm in a BM mood today. What can I say? What can I even say? La la la. Na na na. Party removal could be good, yeah. We kind of dodged a bullet. The guy didn't have Rolling Stone and stuff. Brain Freeze should be a good matchup, though. It doesn't really have much to slow this down. La la la. For a photosynthesizer, ideally. It's pretty good, though. So, against, again, Brain Freeze, uh, instead of playing around Laser, we'll play around Alienu. So, this is going to go on Heights. This will go on the ground. This is an underrated card, guys. I almost ran this in, uh, we actually have to do this. I almost ran this in, um, in Countertron. I found that Erica worked a little better. But yeah, Photosynthesizer. It, it probably is still a good idea. <laughs> la, 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 la. Is Picanolith and Shrinking Violet synergy? Think about it. Just think about it. Is this important? Oh man! Oh, look at this guy! Look at this dude. So he'll play it here at 5 5. Get a garlic, that would be nice. Huh, that's good enough. So it looks like it's gonna be photo. He actually doesn't try to go after us here. God damn, look at it. Man, look at the guy. Man, look at the guy go. Look at the guy go. Look at the guy go. Question is should I try to OTK him? Uh, this will be four, five, six, seven. There's just so much potential here. Gidigado. I'm gonna play it a little slow. Applesauce? Oh. God damn. God damn. God damn. What's better? Cactus or apple? Gidigado. Three bullseye. Or three regular. Three regular is better. Uh, we could use a shamrock. Picanola. That's what I'm... That's what daddy talking about right now. That's what I'm talking about. If he grows... Well, it's not going to grow this one. Ooh, we did it. We're gonna plant food now. Oh, we could take seven damage. We'll be okay. Yeah. It grows ours too. Hello, Mega Tiz. Hey, Zora. We need a leap. I'm a baby. How's it going? Glad to see you back on the stream, Cry. Uh -huh. My life is incomplete without you. You guys are so sweet. That grew. That way. Tell me one thing nothing knows. Ain't nothing but a mistake. I don't ever want to hear you say, Oh, mommy, I don't mean. Mm -hmm. 
Uh, he doesn't have cards. Do we have lethal somehow? Time to shine will do six to his face. I think this grows from the Galacta, so that's not an option. I don't ever want to hear you say... <laughs> this doesn't move. It does move? Since when does that move? Bro, that's so stupid. Since when does that move? Well, we gotta just take out his cards now, I guess. It's so annoying. I'll get the, the hover goat back. This should... No, oh yeah, this always dies. It's just easy to take out now. I don't ever want to hear you say... Probably play the hover goat here. I want it. Man, uh, I hope it's not nuts or berries, man. Should I photo here? Okay, well. Ain't nothing but a mistake. I don't know. Well, he didn't play the goat. It could just be like something really expensive. I mean, I hope it's not a Yeti. Yeah, oh, damn. So, yeah, the Pekanolith, bouncing Pekanolith doesn't make him win. We know the last card is Hover Ghost, so we are safe as hell here. He does two damage. So we'll have, again, Hover Goat plus one card. I don't ever want to hear you say. Hopefully it's not another removal, because we could probably just win here. Looks like the Cactus is going to be really good, though. That's the one. He's just clogging lanes now. Oh, come on. So we have six, seven, eight. No, oh, come on. So how do we do this? Tell me. So five, six, seven, eight. No. It's sad, but we're not getting much damage here. We have to make this train. I guess it's like... Like this. Uh, Rumble goes a long way here. Denies a card. Is that correct? I can't tell if that's correct. It makes us not get a card though. I thought it was stupid. Honestly, this cat lady is not gonna be a big force anymore. I don't know, there probably was a better way to do that. What's that? So we, uh, to I feel like I'm missing something here. Guess the cactus living is good though. And the cat lady dying is good. There's no way to actually kill the goat here, but we get two cards now. I still don't like our position. Cause now he gets goat plus something. We do have an empty lane. I don't know, 
still get goat plus something now. Garlic's nice, team up. Just in case. Thank you, Just Jace. 420. The grind. Really appreciate it. So we got goat plus hover goat. Nice. So he's going for this one. Man. <laughs> well, we do this. I guess we do this too, right? There's bullseye. No blocks. So we can get acid rain. Nothing really matters here. We just need like a plant food. The acid rain. That goes away. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know what we're doing. Where's plant food? So he has two cards to deal with three lanes, hopefully. Hopefully he just plays, yes. So that's game. That's guaranteed now. Tell me why. I don't ever. Yes! Guys, OTK Cactus, I don't care. That game was not clean at all. We just really needed more plant food, more finisher, shamrock at something, but. Anyway, we got it done. We I don't ever wanna hear you say. I mean, that could be good here. They don't have a way of protecting it, but you know what? It, it stops the Infinity Clones. We'll just set up the... We'll let this die next turn and set up the Triceratops. It just starts getting... Thick. Since we don't have a way of protecting this, we probably want to play the Galact Galactic Cactus at some point. Um, This dying is okay. Cactus has been amazing. <laughs> is it just worse garlic? Josh. What is he gonna do with it? He can't do a damn thing with that. Man, can't do, can't do, dang, can't do, damn. Not a damn thing. I'm not even worried. I don't care. I'm literally playing this. He can't play any tricks. Oh, he could get infinity clones. That would suck. You can also get strength or deadly. There's actually a bunch of things. God damn it. That's fine. Everything is fine. I think we're winning, guys. Fairly certain. Bruh. What is this? It's, it's Pogo. What do we want to live here? What do we want to get bounced? I don't know. We'll just take the most damage, which is three bullseye. Oh, he go face! He go! He go face! Look at this guy go! The good news is, unless he pulls off some crazy flamenco or something, time to shine just wins. Oh my gosh, plan for time to shine. So we have lethal in three lanes right now, and we also have a sham rocket. I don't ever want it. Yes, OTK Cactus! OTK Cactus! <laughs> Let's go, guys. OTK Cactus OP. <laughs> How many times are we going to do that? The deck is living up to its name, and we're five and <laughs> That's fine. Bullseye is great there. Imagine this was a high attack guy without Bullseye, and still wouldn't have worked. I mean, one shot would have killed him, but we just needed three damage there, right? So I guess a two damage numbers. <laughs> Shut up! Cactus OP! That's how it's done. I think we just keep the Shamrock against Boogs. Plays a bunch of annoying big things like Bounty Hunter and stuff like that. We gotta get rid of. Uh, so in this matchup, this goes on heights and this goes on the ground. Playing around Trapper territory and Alien News. Yeah. 
Yeah, we're just 5 and 0. Casual 5 and 0. See if he saved a lightning bolt for the Tricare attempts. I'm guessing he didn't. I'm guessing he didn't want to have. He didn't want to. Okay, he has. Um, evaporate. Ah, oh, that sucks. Good play. Our Galactic just killed our guy. Feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. So we'll just play on Curf. Tell me why I don't ever fall. Fruitcake! Never mind. So what's his superpower then? Why did he not fruitcake this last turn? Very confused. See, all this can we would have lightning for sure would have lightning bolted. There is backup dancers. Tell me why I don't ever want to hear you say I think we trade damage right now since he's in much bigger trouble than us. I wish I could have one more plan food so we can OTK him with this coming up. Our guy's protected, so usually the, the guy only has one health, yeah. It doesn't matter. Cool doggo. If he has Valkyrie in his hand, that'll matter, because it charges it an extra time to catch your guy die. Why no prickly pear in this deck? It's so good for Rock and his cactus synergy. I miss my girlfriend. Prickly pear? <laughs> no, I'm not running it. No, guys, we have it! Guys, it's guaranteed lethal because we topped the plan food! Guys, this deck is cracked, man. What is going on today? <laughs> This legitimately, like, might be a thing, like, competitively, instead of, even instead of, what's it called? Instead of, instead of peas, instead of Gatling, how good is the plant foods, man? That's crazy, bros. Would Gatling getting five damage ever be better than just grape responsibility plant food? Holy smokes with this. Hey, Sam, I just got a new... 100,000 bits. Holy crap. I've never even seen that before. Thank you, Savage, for your everlasting, long term, committed, devoted support to the stream. And I still have to make the OnlyFans. It's part of the deal. God damn. Server 6 and 0. This <laughs> deck is dominant like crazy. Uh, Tricaridub goes on heights in this matchup. No alien news, but there's some things called lasers. I don't like lasers. I don't like them. Uh, the thing we don't want to see here is a toxic waste imp. That would suck. I, I mean, we're kind of running this as a joke. The cactus still is a joke, but like... I, the health nut stuff, man, this deck is crazy. I love the fact we're running Photosynthesizer anyway, because of Guardian Package. This is some cracked stuff right here, man. Fireworks. Yeah. Beauty of Cowboy. So the question is, should I play Galactic Cactus here in order to kill this Firework Zombie? I'm going to root wall this one. I think we root wall, yeah. It's got to be worth it. I think this is the play. We have two plus two next turn, so we can play on curve with the sand. Is this worth it though? Maybe the Galacta just needs to. Uh, probably it's actually not worth it. The Galacta kind of needs to go face there. I probably should have. Well, I don't know. It's nice how this three damage on this Triceratops is suddenly gone. This is a good play. I, I think this is alright. He hasn't shown us a superpower yet. Um, now he isn't he's doing this on turn four. I can't overcommit to this though. I can't play two cards. He didn't show us a superpower. Oh no, he did. He played in Crypt, sorry. We don't have to play around deadly. We do have to play around barrel of barrels though. 
You think he has it? He's running fireworks. The chance of barrel barrels are pretty high. Uh, I'm gonna just play this because it has the most impact without committing two cards. And also it doesn't die to splash damage here. Wow, he didn't have anything, okay. Yeah, my bad, guys. La 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 la. This Picanolith is looking awfully good right now. Hostwa. I like it. It sets up for future turns, too. And if he he gets punished really hard from playing Fruitcake here, he grows both of them. There's a laser. A freaking laser beam. Uh, Triceratops and Wand still lives, though. Lives with, like, three health going into next turn. I mean, we're dominating. We've got lethal here. We'll set up lethal in another lane easily. And he has so many things. I mean, he just has too many things he's got to deal with here. So, I think the... Um, this is pretty good, the forget-me-nuts. So this will be six damage. Not quite lethal. I think we're, we have to play forget-me-nuts anyway. And then we'll set up the bullseye. Win. Now, really, well, what can he, can I most play a bungee plumber this turn? So Cactus wins again! Cactus wins! <laughs> Easy, and again, the bullseye does matter there. Wow. Holy smokes. <sighs> Alright, that's the highlight intro. That's the one. <laughs> Subtle spoiler again, Cactus wins. Incredible. Incredible. Going for the 10-0 dream. I like these. I'll look for one more early game card. Photo's really not terrible to keep there. I always keep forget-me-nuts. Pass! Just pass! Goes in heights playing on Trapper territory. Man, this deck is kicking it. Seven three doable. I don't know about that. We don't commit this. It's so much more powerful with health, not and Pete Canolith. We have time to shine too. Yeah, never, never use this in this deck when you have time to shine and health attackers. Hell yeah. I feel bad um, committing this. This probably is just a teleportation zombie anyway. Ooh, maybe not. Is this the leap deck, leap mustache maybe. A brain vendor. There's leaps. This guy's got leaps and all kinds of stuff. He's not even worrying about my triceratops, which is kind of annoying. It's not really good to double up yet for anymore. Stomp it on. I really wanted something we could shamrock it. It would have been nice. This is a valve deck. Be careful. Perhaps. Whoa! <laughs> Come on, man! Fry, are you a fan of the Three Stooges? Uh, summoning a backup dancer's cover says Three Stooges! Not so much. It's nice to see clips. A little too silly for me, maybe. Okay, four, eight. But then it gets blocked. Oh, we can't really do this. We don't got a whole lot to do here, man. 
I guess we go... I guess we just play this. I don't think you're preserving this with these OTK potentials. It's worth it, ever. Man, I, I'm so sad that we couldn't play Shamrocket there because that would have... It would have taken so much off the board. Oh, the stomping on's killing us. Bruh. Okay. Okay, another stomping on charge. Just 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 to say goodbye. Just to hit the road with another one. Now every card he plays is gonna be stupid. I don't know, it's very unlikely because of that for us to win this game now. I mean we have a sham rocket, so maybe I don't know, maybe I don't know. Oh my god, just stop. Okay, good. Still, still can't you? Sh I mean, can you shamrock it now, probably? I guess I pick Canalith in one and try to go for an OTK. I guess that makes sense. Shamrock it plus all these will be playable. This is so dumb. If he can kill the Picanalith here, we're just gonna lose. It doesn't really make sense to. Sh well, we could shamrock it now. And save this for an OTK. Maybe playing slow really is the way. It means we have a 6 drop to deal with next turn. This is a turn 7 combo we'll have lethal. He can still fruitcake, but if this gets fruitcaked, we're done. Alright. Alright. The other cute thing we can do is actually to make garlic here, which will move this out so it stays as a 3-3. Three, three. And garlic would be a lot to fruitcake. If we kick this one, it would actually be a decent play. If he's smart. Mm, no, no. <laughs> Bunging this one? Bunging this one would have made a 3-1 go face and also make a 6 drop. That was crazy. He's way overvaluing the forget-me-nuts there. Or he missed it. Okay, so now... I mean, if he commits a big guy, we kind of win. See, this is very likely just going to be a 3-drop. Even a 2, he's, he can't play Fruitcake anymore. 11 damage wins, so that means he's rolling double ones. We, we go for the win here. Here's an OTK Picanolith for you. And worst case scenario, we'll have it next turn. And that's it. That's guaranteed lethal. Get ro Okay, he has to roll double ones. That's the last hope. No, 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 no. Oh, no, wait. Oh no no, the Picanalith makes it not lethal. It's only 10 damage. Yes! <laughs> yeah! Get wrecked! Get wrecked. It's guaranteed. It's guaranteed. Thanks, Picanalith. Man, I've gone away from Picanalith forever. This deck is insane! We always listen, I used to do OTK okay Picanalith, which is kinda like a control deck. It had way too many, you know, walnuts and then primal walnuts and stuff. What about a deck? That's just Guardian Pack. can do as many Guardian Hero. It's just Guardian Package. Super insane OP early game. Run some cards maybe like Garlic and, you know, that, that benefit. And Picanalith is just a finisher. Not just a finisher, but it's just the one-turn kill. Freaking crazy nut. I mean, this is just insane. This deck is, is, is outperforming. This is really good. With Grass Knuckles, the key is, though, even though you can do with any Guardian Heroes, that you have time to shine and plan food, which seem to be really a necessary part of this. So, Grass, this really is a Grass Knuckles deck, but, I mean, this is crazy. This is like... <laughs> the games that are closed, we're finishing off with an OTK. But most of the games that aren't closed, we're just dominating them. I don't know, man. This deck is cracked. And this really differentiates it from any of the other OTK Picanolith decks. It's the fact we're running just... I bet this deck could even get better, man. <laughs> just the things we could do. I love the fact we're running, unironically, four photos and four um, great responsibilities. It's crazy. I'm going to get rid of this against Rustball, against Hardy Heroes. Kind of rough to keep all these little uh, weed spray targets. I'm probably not going to spam this on one since we don't have a follow-up. Unless he plays teacher, that's the exception. Gotta kill their engine. Alright, so we're 8 and 0, so the answer is already yes. Congratulations to the 59%. Let's go for the 10 and 0 here, man. Yeah, I know, we just need a guy with squirrel. <laughs> 
Shut up. Okay, so we'll pass. Be true to our thing. Zam. God damn. I'd love if he played a minion here, man. I want to just stack these. I, I think we might stack these regardless. There's a turn four weed spray. That's scary. Hmm. I, I think we're passing one more. The, the worst thing you can do right now is teleport teacher. You can play beam me up. Tournament deck worthy? I, 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 I'm curious. I'm curious if Picanolith is good enough in this kind of deck. Okay, so he played Beam Me Up. Who cares? So now if he passes, now is when we commit this. It's a great opportunity to set up this garlic. He can't play Weed Spray. The most he can do is Rolling Stone. And this is also 3 damage. I mean, this isn't a terrible thing to do to his health total. So he Beam Me Up's there. This looks like a Trickster deck. Uh, we gotta play around Weed Spray this turn, though. I almost hope we get Weed Sprayed, because that means the, uh... The Pecanolith gets a lot better. Alright, so we'll play patiently. I have to play around Weed Spray. It's good enough now. He, he kind of has to. He can't just... If he would bluff... You know, there's another level of the game where he bluffs me and then I play into Weed Spray next turn, but well, I don't think we're... I don't think we're there yet in this game, guys. Are there any new viewers because Zach Scott posted a video? <laughs> I don't know how I would know. YouTube doesn't say which subscribers you share with like a different source or anything like that. Okay, that's annoying. Um, okay, so there is a 12 damage play here with the health nut. Pecanolith just seems so sad here. <laughs> We're, we're taking too much damage is the problem. The candleth means we can set up for a different turn, but I don't really like it. I think double Galacta will clear this guy's field. And then we'll set up something of our own. It could be a health nut. It's probably just just this. We should probably, I guess we set up garlic too. Right. It prevents three damage to our face. It, it's just worth it. We're, we're we're need to spend our to spend our money here. So he ends up with no board. We end up with a the cactus is the cool the cool part of this. Oh, I I didn't realize this wouldn't have died if we didn't play the garlic. I don't know why. And the garlic does die. I don't know what I was thinking there, but, um, okay. We we weathered the storm. We got ten health left. Ugh, there's Teacher now. Teacher pass is not what we really wanted to see here. We're in trouble! I don't like this. <laughs> this is not a good position to be in. There's no point in growing anything. We'll save this for when we get a, a bonus attack. The thing this does play well into is going viral. Any removal, which he can still top deck here, it's not good into. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's rough. He's playing a bunch of cards this turn. Did he get like a deadly? Would be good. Chop obviously doesn't do anything. But if this Pecanolith can live, it opens up some possibilities here. Really? Okay. That means we're getting seven, though. So he'll. He might as well go after the cactus. Uh, so he's getting three plus three. Are we in blocking range? No, we're not. Why not kill the cactus, though? Just kill it for free. That's so stupid. What is he doing? Kill the... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> this is three bullseye. This is not a not a laughing matter. Getting his health up. Yeah, you're going to need it after taking all this bullseye damage. Okay. I'm almost upset because I want to see how this game goes if he actually makes the right play. Now he's. I don't know, man. He's in trouble. Can I get a plant food, please? Gosh. 
But it seems like he doesn't really have... Like, uh, you know, we he already played a weed spray. How do we do this? I think we set up another canalith. We live and die with the... Um... Live and die with the, uh, the the weed spray here. We we can't play around anymore. It's just not an option. This means if he has a rolling stone, these two are pretty important too. So, if he rolling stones, this it's okay. If he had rock wall, <laughs> imagine he got rock wall super brains power there. Ah, ah, the fail comp. We're not. I don't feel confident here, but he doesn't have these obvious. He's teleporting things in now. That's good. Man. That's what we want to see. A trickster would probably kill us here. You know what? Teacher, but he just has going virals. They're not good enough. He needs roll. He already used that weed. Kind of debated him with that weed spray. No! He tapped! He just got that. He. Oh. Bro! Now we're done. We're done. There's not. We can't deal with a 5 4 even if we block. Come on, man. <laughs> Bro. No, we're done. 8 and 1. Why is he disconnecting? <laughs> yes, we won. It was guaranteed lethal. If we block, our superpowers are time to shine. Holoflora, we use Root Wall and Rumble. None of them do a damn thing. I'm counting those a loss. Bruh. That's rough though. It's two weed sprays. Well, that's how you beat this deck. Because <laughs> we figured out how. Two weed sprays. Come on, man. Bruh. Alright. Sniper, maybe. I mean, the guy who runs just teacher and weed sprays. It could have been a sniper. Either way, I'm glad that exposes a, a potential weakness in this deck. I don't think there's anything wrong with that. We'll go with the Galacta first. We'll set this up again. Against hardy heroes, you typically want to play this a little later. Probably a snipe. Yeah. Maybe. So, it's either Sumo... Swashbuckler, Monkey Pirate, or that's it. <laughs> uh, this doesn't die to any of the above. We also have, like, things we do next turn. I think I'd rather this trade, the, 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 the Sumo and the Triceratops, rather than the, um, the Galacta. The Galacta dying. This is just does more. This Sumo is not really relevant since we're going to be drawing cards and this Triceratops is going to be out, off the hook here. Off the hook! There's that. La 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 la. The Forget-Me-Nuts doesn't actually do anything this turn except for take damage, so... We could play Cactus and draw cards. Uh, that's probably fine. And we'll save the photosynthesizer for the forget-me-nuts. We can also make the galactic cactus live, but... Okay, so draw first. Let's say we'll draw first. Let's see what we can. This goes. And we'll set up cactus. Tech, I'm technically 9 and out, that's true. Technically. We're talking technically. So now what we do is just set everything up. We have to still play around Weed Spray, but he's not going for Weed Spray in this board. It could be Pogo. Well, let's assume it's Pogo. We'll go with... You. You. I'd rather not play a second Forget Me Nuts here. Because we want there to be some board space. It's probably Pogo anyway, so I should play this, right? 
On the other hand, what's really the point of playing this? It's just block meter charge. It's Pogo. So he bounces this, Pogo dies, we have a board. We also have, the, the cool thing about this play is not only did it kill the Pogo so he can't mug anymore, but it sets up seven damage in this lane for the Bacchanal Lip. Also, Weed Spray is so inefficient because we have a Forget-Me-Nuts. He'd have to basically pass here for, to be able to play Weed Spray. Or that. There it is. He got this, so that only costs two. So can't weed spray. Pecanoff is okay here. Where are the other options? We can play these two cards, which is fine. Awfully fine. This does a whole bunch of bonus attacks, though. This actually goes back and kills the cucumber in one. It's gotta just be Pecanoff. See if he has a rolling stone. Even like a healthy treat is not going to make this guy survive here. Was Pecanothin 1 a little bit better? Because 7 damage is a lot nicer than 3 here. Uh, that obviously doesn't, <laughs> doesn't do anything. Well, hopefully we'll just get 3 plus 7 anyway. Yes we do. Man, I could use a, I could use like a bullseye minion with a decent amount of health here. It's really what I could use right now. <laughs> this guy needs to clog these two lanes just for starters, just to have a chance of surviving here. This will be a perfect way to end the stream, guys. Get wrecked! Hell yeah! OTK Cactus. Imminent. Anyway, guys. Anyway, guys. This was amazing. This was incredible. Again, we had the one maybe sniper who weed sprayed us a couple times so otherwise this deck was indestructible I, I think i'm actually gonna make a really sweaty version of this deck probably without the cactus in it but uh this was great and again the cactus was fine it was quite fine hope you guys enjoyed that was uh, an absolutely amazing incredible stream definitely going on youtube ot cactus peace this is right